Hey, beautiful souls. Happy Friday the 13th. Happy Sacred Divine Feminine Day. Happy Venus Day. So, I wanted to do a little Friday the 13th video. And to me, this is the Divine Feminine Day. Okay, the Divine Mother Day. Okay, we have 13 moon cycles. And so, Divine Feminines have around 13 uh, periods a year. And so, when you do start that, you have the two different moon cycles. So, then you have uh, what's called the white moon cycle. And then you have what's called the red moon cycle. So, the white moon cycle is when you have your cycle, when the new moon is. And um, this is going to represent death okay and this is also a time to focus on being a divine mother when you are in your red moon cycle this is when you're going to have your cycle with the full moon this is going to represent rebirth this is when you really should be focused on your shamanic healing your shamanic um it, your focus really should be on healing and shamanism during that time. I do know that when I am in my red moon cycle, that's when I'm going to be the strongest at being able to move energy, send Reiki, all of those things. And it, we, we are always going through the changes. We're always going through the cycle. So it's never really going to be the same all year long, right? Because we're constantly changing. Um, 13 is a very potent spiritual yin and feminine energy, divine mother, the feminine, goddess of transformation, death and rebirth, fertility, blood, power, and life. Uh, Mary Magdalene uh, was the 13th apostle. And Friday is also named after Frigg, which is the goddess of love, fertility, and motherhood, also known as Freya, which Freya started showing up for me in roughly 2021 with all the random cats. And Freya was with me up like for a really long time. So I never called Freya in, Freya just showed up. And that's really how it works. When it's time for you to start working with somebody, they just show up and they're kind of like, hey, I'm here. Um, it's also seen, um, well, I've already told you that. It's 13th in numer numerology. K is a karmic number. It can bring good luck, prosperity, growth. Um, and change. It can when avoiding your spiritual growth, this is going to show up to get you back on track. But also, death card is represented by 13 in the major arcana. So I did want to pull that. Okay. So you see, the death card is represented by 13. It also represents transformation power okay so today is a very powerful day if you have any intentions that you would like to set today would be a great day to do it um you could always do your bay leaf and instead of doing cinnamon you can add a little allspice to kind of buff it up a little bit yes i did and it was amazing. I'd never tried it. And I'd always heard people suggest. So, you can do that too. All right. So, I love you guys. Happy Friday the 13th. Happy Divine Feminine's Day. Divine Mother Day. And I love you guys. And we'll talk very soon.